Hi, I'm Kelly, or Teacher Kelly, in the online ESL world. I work six jobs. So they are three online ESL companies, VIP Kid, Go Go Kid, and now Native. I am a freelance videographer. I am a tutor for Varsity Tutor and a substitute teacher. So I had someone ask me recently, how do you work all those jobs? So let's be clear, I'm not working all six jobs at the same time. I don't work six jobs in a week. That is the nice thing about being an independent contractor and a freelancer. You can pick and choose, but also sometimes the work comes and goes, so it is great to have many different options. My very first company is VIP Kid. I open seven days a week from five to nine, with some variation because that's the nice thing is that it's flexible. My freelance video job, which has been there for me for over five years. It's a good skill to have. I worked in the video business even longer than being with that company. I don't want to lose the skill. The downside is with freelance, it comes and goes, and it's an hour away and outside the house. So all of the jobs have advantages and disadvantages. I very recently started working for varsity tutors. So far I have one client or two students, they are brothers, and that supplements nicely with the online ESL teaching. It is not from home, but is very close to home, so that is close enough and counts for me. So my backup ESL companies are GoGo Kid. I open half hour to an hour a day before I start my classes at VIP Kid. It is not peak hours, so I don't always get booked, but I do get booked sometimes, and I have that company there. If something were to happen with VIP Kid today, they fire me, the company goes under, I can just open slots at GoGo Kid. Native starts very soon, and since they are based out of Japan and Korea, they will have different peak hours than the Chinese companies. I did a whole different video on that if you want more information about that. But I have different hours and I will decide when they open how I'm going to juggle that. So last but not least is substitute teaching. It is something that is just almost always there. I say almost because of course in the summer you can't work there. But pretty much if all the other jobs are slow, you can pick up a sub job almost any time. They have half day jobs. They have full day jobs. If I have an appointment in the afternoon, I can pick up a sub job in the morning. If I have classes going on in my ESL classroom during daylight savings and they go until 10, I can pick up a job that starts at 12. It is just always there. Now, I have had times when I have not diversified, and you know the downside of that. Over the summer, I just had my freelance job and substitute teaching. Well, you know substitute teaching ends in the summer, and my freelance job got really slow. And that was during the time I decided to try to apply for the online ESL companies. And as you know, that process can take a long time. Plus, I had some internet problems I figured out I needed to work out, which I eventually did. So during that time, I had no work. And being an independent contractor and a freelancer, I've gone through ups and downs where I've had work, I've had no work, you know, ups and downs. So that is why I work six jobs. Now I can diversify, I have more freedom to choose, I need to be able to choose on my own schedule for per personal reasons. So. For example, I decided I'm taking my freelance job off for the winter. I need to be there if it snows and my kids are off school. I have the freedom to do that now. And I can just do my ESL companies and substitute teach. In the summer, I plan to just work online ESL and tutoring, and then I can be there more for my kids. So as you can see, you just have more options and more things the more that you have. Even within the online ESL, and I looked into many companies, 
I needed ones that let you choose your own schedule and did not have a set schedule and did not have a minimum number of hours, which is why I chose the three that I did. I need complete flexibility. So let me know below, how many jobs do you work as a freelancer and independent contractor? What do you do? I'm curious. If you are interested in applying for VIP Kid, Go Go Kid, or Varsity Tutors, I will leave the links below. VIP Kid and Go Go Kid, I will help you through the application process. Varsity Tutor is a very simple interview, but I will answer any questions that you have. So let me know what you do. Again, I'm Kelly or Teacher Kelly.